All right, let's give it up for Brighton Bar favorite, Tadpole Triple. Y'all give it up for Angelo and the Brighton Bar one time. Mike and Sean, I appreciate y'all. Shout out to all the veterans. All those that make the ultimate sacrifice. All those that serve take the greatest risk for 400 million strangers to give us the freedom to come up here and be as ridiculous as we like. I had to say whatever the fuck we want. To be a bunch of ungrateful, inconsiderate, miserable bricks if that's what we choose to be. <laughs> greatest freedoms in the history of the world. The greatest risk I have to take is whether or not to try to squeeze out a fart after eating some chipotle. <laughs> you know, it might be a squirt. God damn it, it might be a squirt. But we got it good, y'all. We got it good. 1,500 channels and nothing to watch. I wonder what my daddy would think of a Tide Pod challenge. A fucking Kylie Jenner lit challenge. The fuck is this world coming to? That's what he say. The fuck out of here. I got a challenge for y'all. How about the decent human being challenge? <coughs> right? 11-11 for 11 days. Let's all try to be the best human being in every equation we enter. Regardless of the barriers. <coughs> Right, someone comes at you with some bullshit, swerve. Uh, 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 uh. Swerve the fuck out of the way. I got somewhere I'm trying to be. If I get there and you're there, we can lick and kick it. I ain't got no time for no bullshit. Takes little effort to be kind. Takes hella resolve. <laughs> you know, I got hella resolve. But instead of going head first into some bullshit, just swerve, right? Put your blinker on, no blinker, blinker, uh, uh, uh. The fuck out of the way. Time is the most precious commodity in the world, yet it's what we waste the most of. Woo. Right? You can't trade it on NASDAQ. No matter how much money you got, you can't get more. Swerve the way out of all the bullshit, y'all. Decent human being challenge, 11 11 2020. I'm going to issue it to the world. See what it feels like when you're going out of your way to be the best human being and someone one-ups you on some humanity? It'll fucking blow your mind. You're doing everything to be the best person there is, and you're like, God damn, I didn't even know I was a shitty person. You know, if I really doing some real life shit, we can all do better. That said, can I tell you all some fucked up jokes? Yeah. Woo. Yeah. You know, I try to be a gentleman. But what the fuck do you say to a gal that looks 16 months pregnant? Fucking <laughs> well, hang in there. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck do you say? You're glowing. What you can't? What do you say? Right? All you really want to say is fucking push. I'm about to get. Just fucking push. I'm about to give birth to a third grader. Jesus. Christ. <laughs> Jeffrey Epstein. Hey, Gary, you know Jeffrey Epstein? Yeah, he didn't kill himself. <laughs> what is the truth for 200, Alex? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Jeffrey Epstein. You know, before this pervert, I thought sex trafficking was when your girl and your side piece showed up at the same damn time. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you're like, what are y'all, what are y'all gonna have to wait? What are y'all gonna have to wait? Unless you all want to merge. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You want to merge. You know, I always get caught up at the jug handles. Oh, oh what was that Jeffrey Epstein bit, Gary? He didn't kill himself. <laughs> Y'all know I think my daddy created GPS. You know, when I was a young and about nine, he taught me how to drive. Yeah, because he needed a way home from the bar. <laughs> he'd, be, he'd be laying there, yeah, he'd be laying there. 
He'd be laying down on the front seat, head down, put his hand up. He'd be like, oh, when you get down yonder, do like this here. You want to do like, go up yonder, and do like this here. <laughs> no, no, want to make a left. You want to do a leaner. He's like more like a leaner. Like a, you want to lean into it, not the hard left, a leaner. That's what I remember from my childhood. <laughs> Did you ever drive by a gal? You know, you get to wave. And as you approach, you wish you could take that shit back. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like she went from soccer mom to soccer cleat. Quick as a motherfucker. Yeah. You know what I mean? She had a couple snaggle tooths and shit. Looked like a pair of Deodoras. <laughs> Y'all know I don't go down on the heifers. Because <laughs> sometimes I eat the ass and it's harder for them to wipe. Harder. Harder. Right. Some of y'all might know this little ditty. I know it's been banned from schools because of a bunch of little crybabies and shit. But I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands when they shoot when they die in the physical with liberty and justice for all. You can kiss my daddy's ass. I love you, Brighton Bar. Give it up for the next comment, Ziggy.